Hey guys, it's Jamie here. Welcome to my channel or welcome back to my channel if you guys have already been here before. Today I'm just going to be doing a shorter video. I'll be doing a influencer unboxing video. I figured I would do a shorter video today since a couple of my recent videos have been kind of longer. So today we're just going to do a little short unboxing. Um, I know this one just from the box looks like Revlon products, like rosy, rose glow product type things. Um, so I'm assuming it's going to be just only cosmetics this round, but let's open her up and see. Okay. It's all rosy thanks to Revlon. Look fresh, radiant, and rosy all season long. Prime your skin for a lit from within glow using Revlon Photo Ready Rose Glow Primer. Drench your lips in Revlon Ultra HD Vinyl Lip Polish in Birthday Suit for high pigment vinyl shine. Complete your look with enviable pink nails with Revlon Namel, Nail Enamel in Koi. Cool! So it looks like it's just going to be those three products this time. So this is the nail polish. I actually really like this. It's like a very pastel type pink. Goes really good with my skin tone. So that's great for me. And then this is the primer. So it looks like it just has kind of a little like uh, tincture type. Oh, that's nice. Very cool. So you can just drop the specific amount of primer. I hate when primers are a squeeze bottle because then it like every time you squeeze it like a different amount of product comes out. But this is like a little tincture. So that's that. I don't know if you guys can even see that. So that's cool. I've never used primer like this so that'll be interesting for me to try. I've only ever used like cream uh, primers. So that'll be really nice. And then lastly, we have the Revlon Ultra HD Vinyl Lip Polish. High Shine and Haute Brilliance. Uh, what did they say this one was in? The shade in this one is Birthday Suit. So I really like this one too because... Oh, let's see if you guys can focus on that. There we go. That's kind of focused. Not really, but I really like this because... It's a really nice, like, neutral type pink. Actually, it's kind of similar to what I'm wearing today. So I'm going to go ahead and put some on right now. Ooh. Ooh, that's really nice, actually. It's not sticky at all. I hate when a lip gloss or a lipstick gets really sticky. That's, like, the worst thing ever. But this one goes on really nice. Nice and glossy. And I really like, I'm really excited to try this Revlon nail polish. I've actually in my entire life never tried a nail polish by Revlon before. Nothing against their product, I just, I have never have worn Revlon nail polish before. So that'll be really cool and I love this color. It's like super summertime, springy, but you can also kind of transition it into fall with like grays and things like that. So it's just a really good color to have in your color swatches of nail polish. Not that I need any more nail polish because I literally have a bin like this big full of nail polish that I never wear. So Lord knows why I have it. But I have it and it's there. And then again with the Rose Glow Primer, I'm really, really excited to try, try this because I've never tried one that wasn't like a lotion type primer. And there's a lot that comes in this bottle. Like it's not completely full to the top, like it doesn't go all the way up to here, but it's probably like right there full with product. Which is insane because if you guys know anything or if you guys have experienced the same things that I have, when you buy a primer, the bottle is like this big and then the product is like to there and you're like... That is it for today's unboxing video. There were only three products in this box, so sorry that the video was shorter than I thought it would be. If you guys like these influencer unboxing videos or my BarkBox unboxing videos, I think this month's BarkBox is going to be my last before our subscription runs out. Honestly, if I had the money for it, I would keep the subscription going forever, but I just don't have the money right now. We're trying to save up and buy a house of our own, so... 
having to cut back on things like that. Really, really like doing these unboxing. I love all the products that they've sent me thus far. It's a really great program. If you guys aren't signed up for it, you definitely should. There's not... I don't think that there's too many requirements for it, but I'll go ahead and leave my link in the description if you guys want to sign up for Influencer. It's really cool. All they ask in return is that you leave your honest opinions about the products. You know, you're not posting things to, you're not getting paid for this, so it's not like you have to say what they want you to say. They want you to be honest so that these companies can improve their products. That's the point of the influencer box. And that's why I really like to do it because I feel like for me, having as sensitive skin as I do, and I'm very sensitive to new products and things like that, I feel like me being able to try all of these different things and then leaving my opinion as somebody who has sensitive skin for other people who have sensitive skin, I feel is very helpful and that's why I personally chose to be a part of this to help people like me who when I was 16 and I had super sensitive skin, I just wasn't wearing makeup and wasn't using these products because every single time I was using them, nobody was leaving reviews saying, oh, it's great for sensitive skin or, you know, actually I have sensitive skin and maybe you should stay away from this product. So that's the main reason that I wanted to start doing it and if you have sensitive skin too, I hope that my videos or my reviews on any of these products have helped you to narrow down your search for products that are sensitive skin friendly. Anyways, that is it for today's video. I love you guys so much. Thank you for all of your love and kindness and support and I'll see you guys in the next video. Bye!